This quilt is entitled Up From The Depths and it is a slice of coral reef was the intent. And I used photographs from diver and photographer Lee Cooper, who I met in some of my gallery shows of fish quilts. And she let me use her photographs in the making of this quilt. And it is documented in my first book, Freestyle Quilts. And um, you get to, you can, you can see that from beginning to end, from the first uh, drawings, from the photographs I used, the, fo the fabric that I chose, or began to choose with it, and then down to the very finished interpretation. Got the moray eel. I tried to place animals and, um, you know, rocks and plants where they would be in this slice of reef life. In um, each of the coral reefs that I did, and this is one of probably about a dozen different coral reefs that I made in the, the 90s, I would put a little blue crab in each one. And if you look right there, I'm coming in on the center of it, there's a little blue crab in this one. I did a lot of research on coral reefs and tried to figure out um, what would um, you know, grow where they are, and also how color changes when you're looking at things underwater. And the reds and yellows are something that you would see a little closer up, but um, they kind of disappear with distance in um, when you're looking at something through the water. And the reds kind of disappear, and then the blues take over. So all this foreground coral reef is where the stronger colors are and then that disappears as it moves and um, the uh, and then you're seeing things from more of a distance you know behind the reef itself the shell of the turtle I know is made up with this pheasant feathered fabric that I had and that kind of reinterpreted cut apart and reinterpreted as um, the tortoise shell design worked really well. And then there's some distant, little distant outcropping of a of, um, little bit more reef. There's a school of fish that's kind of printed on that fabric and they are um, kind of swirling in the, the background as well. And then at the very beginning, at the very top I mean, you've got the sunlight coming through the water, and uh, there's a barracuda up there that completes the little slice of life here. 